Hello and welcome to this special edition of Pride Today. My name is Ricky Cornish. Cara Delevingne is busier than ever with two new projects premiering back to back. The star is chatting with me in our exciting new interview. Hi Cara, so nice to meet you. Ricky, nice to meet you too. I love your background. Thank you. Thank you. I got to bring a little color up in the Zoom room, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Spice it up. I love it. Well, Cara, let's jump right in. Let me say congratulations on the second and final season of Carnival Row. I mean, the big question is what are fans getting? We've been waiting for this second season. Yeah, it's been a lot. It's been a minute, um, but I'm so grateful to the fans for waiting. It's well worth the wait, if I can tell you. There is, um, it's just a lot more of everything in season one. Like, it's just magnified. You know, they end up in season one, everyone's being um, segregated to the row, and you kind of see everyone fighting for the ones they love, facing more adversity and kind of what kind of sacrifices that brings um, to their lives. So, it's a lot of action, a lot of conflict, still romance. It's a bit darker, which I like to, I think, uh, Vignette especially st steps up a bit into like a leadership role. So I love that about season two. Yes, I'm so excited to see it. You know, we love seeing you absolutely kill it. And of course we are out magazine and not only yeah. are we super thrilled for this final season, but Carl, we are waiting for Planet Sex. We cannot <laughs> wait to see this project, my friend. Yay! On that as well. I'm so glad. Yeah, no, it's coming out within a week of each other and I'm so grateful. They're such different, different things. Um, but it, both of them have kind of a lot of representation for the queer community, which I'm so, so grateful to be able to be a part of. And I think it's very, very important and needed. So, right. Exactly. Exactly. I have to imagine, like, you know, it's one of those things, like, I'm sure if you could tell your younger self, like, you're going to want to see more representation in the media, but you have to be the person to go out and do it. Yeah, I mean, that's a pinch me moment. Um, I just wish it existed, but me being the one to do it, I'm just... I can't, I, can't, I can't believe it. My younger self is honestly, pinching is not enough. It's like, okay, someone slapped me around the face already. No. Yeah, I'm sure your younger self would be pretty, like pretty shocked to find out that you filmed yourself at a women's only sex party. Am I right? <laughs> I don't know. I don't think I believe it, to be honest. I don't think, wow. You're, that's really blown my brain away. I would be so confused. <laughs> Oh my gosh. It's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot. But Cara, that's what we love about you. You have seriously built your own like lane in the entertainment industry with the modeling and the acting and all the crazy things. I'm curious though, is there anything else you're manifesting or anything else you, anything else you would love to do in this crazy field? Yeah, it's funny. I, I tended to have a lot of goals and now it's like I try not to think too much about the future, but there's a lot of things. I'm, I'm an artist at heart. I'm just a you know, jack of all trades. So I like to kind of create things in any, any aspect. And I think as a model, I wasn't really able to do that. And now I have the opportunity to do a lot of different things, especially in the creative side behind the camera. Um, yeah, I want to create a lot more especially with representation and stories that people need to see, which aren't seen enough of. Hey, before I let you go, I have a really fun question. You have a really <laughs> cute stuffed animal behind you. I need to know the name of the stuffed animal. <laughs> okay, so this lion, he's called Noyle, which is lion backwards, because his left eye was born in his right eye and his right eye was born in his left eye, so he reads backwards. Gar, you are so incredible. I am seriously so thrilled I got the chance to chat with you today. Congratulations you, on all the success. I can't wait to see what's next for you, my friend. Thank you for making me smile. And yeah, I really appreciate that. Thank Anytime. You so much. And I'll be following you on the Insta. Hopefully I'll see you at one of these red carpets one day. Yeah, we will. For sure. I'll find you. <laughs> I love it. Well, Cara, thanks again. Have a great rest of your day. All right. You too. Lots of love.